Now that's a feed. Hey! <laughs> and it's spitting. Pull it back a bit. Yeah, you don't want it too high. Oh, I'll just let that cook away. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do today. Uh, I was wanting to stop in Kilmartin. That's, uh, they've got a whole lot of Neolithic stuff there. Uh, but I can't see any car parks. And this is maybe a wee bit big for, you know, parking in the street. So it looks like I'm going to have to push on to uh, open itself. Now, if I can get parked where I want, uh, I'm going to get a walk along the main street and have a wee wander about. See what we can see. Might even buy something. No, 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 I didn't get to. But I would like there's another place like this. Uh, when I say this, have a look at this. <laughs> this is where I am. There's another place like this. I think it's called Cavic Canavan. Uh, we'll take a trip up there and we'll see if we can park up there for the night. But anyway, oh, oh, let's see what's happening here. Ah, oh, yeah, beautiful. Oh, look at that. Uh, that's what you call a Scottish breakfast. Couple of bits of bacon, couple of bits of tomato, couple of black puddings and a flat sausage. Oh, that is a feed. Now I'm going to get this done man. Then I'm going to stretch my legs and we'll get on the road. And we'll stop a few times up the road and let you see what like it is. It's a beautiful place. And this wee van's doing grand. <laughs> Hoping to get stopped. Ah, I saw an indication to some very park. Oh, this is Lord Gilford. Bro, 
roads are getting a bit narrow. just pulled in off the side of the road. I'm about 20 miles from Oban. Yeah, a nice wee spot. And there's a tartan camper van just having a wee quiet rest. <laughs> ah, somebody's been having a fire here. And Oh, a nice spot for sitting out. And you can get down to the rocks. Oh, that's nice. It's been quite a quick drive. I wasn't driving far today. Uh, what time is it? It's Obian. Oban, the back of 11 o'clock and we'll do a bit of shopping and then we'll go for a wander uh, but this is a fantastic wee spot there's loads of these loads of these doesn't that look good? <laughs> it does look good <laughs> aye that day uh, Steph's packed lunch. <laughs> Aye, Steph, you done me a good turn there. <laughs> don't know, I don't know who thought this one up. <laughs> yeah, I've enjoyed this so far. There's nothing not to enjoy. <laughs> yeah, how close are we to the road? A nice wee drawing. This would make a nice wee spot at night. There's loads of them. And you know something? This is what? Getting towards the end of May. No, towards the end of March. And I've hardly saw another camper van. So the place is nice and quiet. It's not the North Coast 500 or the West Coast 500, whatever they call it. So it's quieter. It's beautiful, nice and relaxed. Anyway, onwards and upwards. Let's go up to Tesco's in Oban. Come on, camper van, we're going for a wee run. The Esplanade at Oban. Watch the boats coming in. Caledonian McBrain. No, nah, that'll be for the. The islands, the Inner Hebrides Maybe even Tobermory Or Iona But look at this <laughs> And there's a the camper van there <laughs> It's getting some looks <laughs> Folk keep waving at it <laughs> I like it <laughs> Anyway I've got two hours to have a wee wander about and I'm going to do that. And here's Caledonia McBrain coming into dock. See if they can do it without hitting anything. And this is the main street in Oban. And of course up there at the top of the hill And some of you might know who used to own that shop. If you don't know, don't ask, please.
Beautiful. Loads of galleries. Loads of places to get something to eat. Oh, I like this. Free town Wi-Fi. Well, I've got a stone in my shoe, so I've got to stop anyway. Yes, so weird and wonderful shops. Oh, whiskey and fine wine shop. Yes, we'll have a look at that. A thriving metropolis. <laughs> look at this. You've got a Turkish kebab. <laughs> uh, an Italian A uh, very very chicken joint And guess what's behind me A chip shop <laughs> Oh And that's another food shop up there uh, spot five five <laughs> five food shops oh yes nice top end of the street and look at that an angler comma well we've got to have a look well that's me being in i got a new knife and open all number five look at him eh? i bet he feels a right idiot with a fishing rod in his hand <laughs> anyway Back to the camper van, the tartan camper van. But, you know, I could make a wee detour. Look at this. No, 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 I'm not drinking. The tartan tavern. <laughs> oh, well, that'd be a place for a tartan caravaner to go, I dare say. Right. Will I get something to eat? I might get a wee snack. I might get a wee snack. Then I'll head back. Canavan Beach Just a wee bit outside Oban Plenty of room here Obviously I, I'm going to try and Yeah, I'll try and camp here tonight but we'll see what happens I might get some flak There's the usual signs but I don't know But look at this this is beautiful. Yeah, nice bit if you've got kids. Now, along here, I believe that there's a maze of some sort. So I'll just take a wander along. Uh, no. I'll go do not well no I'll stay up up here. That's a great place. I used to come here years ago. Uh when I was camping with Isabel and Fiona we like this place there used to be a campsite along there but as you can see it's been bought and all these fancy houses are there now <laughs> well let's have a wee wander about and see what we can see Must have been springs at one time. And here's a path. So we might there might be a maze. <laughs> Mind you, it was an old map I saw it. And here we have a couple of metal detectors. Ah, good luck to them. <laughs> I've got a top of the range metal detector sitting in the house and I've never used it. Oh, there was something I wanted to get into when I retired and 
I just never got the time. Oh, Day a walk. Oops. Oh, it's mucky. Well, this is starting to look interesting here. Butter through. Yes, sure, when you go. Thank you. Thanks. It's quite foggy further up. Oh, I think we'll give it a miss then. Oh, oh God. Oh. Back beach. No, it's too boggy. We're not going through that. Half six at night. Beautiful. We are still here. And there's other camper vans starting to appear. So we'll just get to have a wee walk along the beach. Could be better. I know, I'm lazy. I've not done much today. I've just had a nice relaxing time. And that's what I wanted. Oh, did some planning for tomorrow. Ah, I've got to go back in the oven. Ah, I've got to stock up on things to drink. Uh, Non-alcoholic, of course. Hey, mind you, I'm going to be on a site tomorrow night. I can maybe have a wee party. Yes, yes, I think I'll get something. Uh, I might get one or two things. And it's a very short drive. Uh, tomorrow we're going up to Glencoe. Uh, reasonably short drive. Oh, look at this. And we've even got a wee boat out there. Huh. Well, this used to be a caravan site. Look at it now. Okay. Oh, more egg would like to hear. Well, let's get back up. And we've got a cook up. And then we'll sit and watch a few things on the internet, and that'll be me. Oh. It's dinner time! <laughs> well, we're going to try something tonight. Now, I don't know if it's going to work. <laughs> we're going to try a one pot meal. Ah. Uh, we're going to go for a chicken supreme. Now, I've got one, two, three, four ingredients. I'm going to fry up some mushrooms. Throw 
a tin of chicken and white sauce, a bit of garlic, cheap garlic, it's usually all right actually, and then some rice. Now we'll see what happens. <laughs> it might be all right. <laughs> Who said I? Uh, you'll be bloody lucky. Uh, I think I will be as well, but I'm not going to admit it. <laughs> right, there's everything there. There's a cooker. Let's get on with it. Right. First things first. Ah, we've got the pot on. I don't think you're seeing that. So we'll put a wee bit of oil in. Maybe a wee bit more. <laughs> Ah, uh, now I think there's a light there. Let's see if I can get some light. Oh, oh yes, there we go. Now we're cooking the gas. Right, that's that heated up. And we'll get some mushrooms in. That's one. <laughs> There's more. <sighs> you think that's enough mushrooms? Should be are. And uh, tonight's utensil. Oh, this is looking good. This, uh... oh. Yeah, they are all take care of off. Right, I'll get rid of some of that oil. Like that. Now, let us get in with the chicken and white wine sauce chicken and white sauce Wah! right give that a stir oh. now I'm going to turn that down and let it boil away for a minute Oh, that looks nice. As always, you know someone, I should have put more mushrooms in. I never put enough mushrooms in. Oh. Oh. I'll put more mushrooms in. So now, I'm going to get this in. Garlic paste. This is great stuff. <laughs> is that enough? <laughs> I hope. <laughs> You've got to be careful with garlic paste. I've never used that make before. Sometimes it's alright. Other times, it can be bloody potent. Just a wee tester. Oh, oh, yeah, that's right. Bloody potent. Right, I'll let that simmer away for a wee while. And then we'll come back and uh, put the rice in. I've just tried some, it's done enough. Now it's time, I'll put in half a packet of rice. Right, here goes. Ah, it's a good half packet. I could put a full packet in, but ah, no. Yeah. Now, 
we just give that a stir this is a one pot meal normally you do the rice, se rice separate and just put the the chicken supreme the chicken and the sauce on over it now we'll give that another minute to heat up and then we'll serve up simple as that Oops. Right. Time's up. Let's see what I've got. Okay. Oh, that looks all right. Give it a wee star. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. Right, switch this off. Plated up. Yeah. And there we are. Oh, I've got to try this. Oh. -ho. Yes. That's nice. You saw how simple that was. One pot. Can you check it on white sauce? Some mushrooms. And a wee bit garlic. Okay, I'll be honest, put too much in. <laughs> And I've got a full meal out yet. And for later, Ambrosia creamed rice deluxe. <laughs> Couldn't it be better, could it? Don't answer that. I'm happy with what I'm having tonight. More than happy. Right, I'll see you later. I'm going to get ripped into this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, it's been a good night. Beautiful view out there. Couple of other car uh, well camper vans have turned up. Oh, and it's peace and quiet. It's what must be about back at ten o'clock. Ah, oh, honest, it's iron brew. Oh yeah. <laughs> ah, watching one or two things on the computer. Then I realised I've not brought my charging cable for the computer. <laughs> and you would forget something. Well, there is a charging cable there. It's not for the computer. <laughs> Aye, ah well, these things happen. <laughs> If that's all the mistake I've made this trip, <laughs> that's all right. <sighs> oh, this radio is working out well. Well, just kidding, I've got a new radio. And, uh, been sitting here listening to that and nodding off and. <laughs> Well, it's time for me to bring this bed down. This uh, seat uh, folds down into a bed. Um, it's, that's quite easy to do. It's just a lever underneath. And then pull it forward and jump on it. <laughs> and then get myself sorted out. And that'll be me for the night. <sighs> I'm tired. I've had a long day, but it's been a good day. This is a beautiful spot.
It seems to be the dog walking capital of Auburn. The amount of people that's been here walking their dogs. <laughs> Also, the car parks used by the driving instructors. This must be where they bring folk that's uh, never been in a car before so they can learn clutch work and what have you. Uh, it's a massive car park. There's plenty of room. I suppose in the summer it'll be chock a block, but at this time of the year it's just brilliant. Anyway, tomorrow morning, uh, back in the open. <sighs> I'm running out of iron brew, uh, and I notice where I'm going there's no big shops. Ah, uh, so I'm just getting that back into Tesco's and stock up with what I need and then slowly drive up to Glencoe. It's quite a nice, it's a short drive, it's not far, but it's an awfully drive. Uh, looking forward to that. I'll be in a campsite tomorrow night. Ah, uh, you always plan ahead, and I've done a lot of planning ahead. Oh, I'm really comfortable in here. Oh, I didn't even want to go to my bed. I want to finish uh, that can of iron brew. <laughs> Aye, right, fair enough. <laughs> mm. Oh, yeah, beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Oh, isn't life beautiful? When you look at the alternative, ah, you've just got to live it as it comes. I've been watching some of the other uh, contributors on uh, YouTube. Paul Messner, I was watching his latest thing. He seems to be going through a life crisis. Give him a couple of flaming slaps, Paul. Come on. Go on and enjoy yourself, mate. <laughs> Aye, that's what it's all about. In life, you get your ups and downs. And when you're down, you go up. And when you're up, you go down. That's no doubt there is somebody with a big theory one of these very clever people, anthropologists or something like that, you know, what the heck, just enjoy yourself, live for the day. Well, no, that's not really right, living for the day. But, <sighs> smile, enjoy things. Oh yeah, I intend to. A nice wee drive tomorrow. Nice wee sleep tonight. Oh, I'm ready for that. Aye. Okay, folks. I'll see you at brekkie in the morning. When we're having our full English tomorrow morning. Ah. Well, have a wee brekkie. <laughs> right, folks. I'll see you in the morning. Nighty night. See you later.
Good morning. There we are. How's that? That's beautiful. Oh, I'm a wee wander about. Oh. Right, we've got the breakfast on. Oh. Right, let's see what we've got. Oh, the usual. A nice fryer. Eh? You can't beat it. I had a reasonably good sleep. Uh, that chair folds out and it just slips forward and I crawl on top with my sleeping bag. <laughs> oh. So this is day two over. Uh, it's been interesting. Very interesting. It's a beautiful spot this. So we're going to get this breakfast and then we'll get on the road. Uh, the toilet's over there. Look at that. Oh, it's a pointer. Yeah, the toilet's over there. Uh, I've been in, had a clean up, and we're to go. So, we're going to get the coffee as well. Ding! And sit down, munch his breakfast, and then rock and roll. We're day three, we're getting on the road.